Ah! Uh-oh! The exam! I can't be the next king of games if I'm late to the games! In this series, you, the viewer, will face an exam proctor. Alright, new guy! Multiple choice! You got two monsters staring you down! Do you A, throw in the towel, B, beg for mercy, or C, run home to mama? You will both open 24 packs or one box of a Yu-Gi-Oh! booster set. Build the deck and play the best two out of three. If you are victorious, you move on to face me in the next set. This is an anything goes match where you're only limited to the cards in that set. Winning assures you a place in the upcoming progression tournaments. Welcome to the Yu-Gi-Oh! Progression Draft Exams. Hello everyone and welcome back to the Yu-Gi-Oh! Progression Draft Exams. Here we have a new contestant. Uh, say hello, Sign. Hello. Alright, Sign, tell us a little bit about your Yu-Gi-Oh! background. Uh, I got into Yu-Gi-Oh! through watching the anime, like I'm sure most people have. When I was little, probably like six or seven. Haven't, didn't really pay too much attention to it, so didn't really know the rules until like a year ago when I started making a Discord bot for someone, and then that really got me into the game. So for this past year, I've kind of been gradually learning and getting better. It's, it's, a, of, it's a great yeah. game, for sure. Um, so you've never played competitive Yu-Gi-Oh! Yeah, not really competitive Yu-Gi-Oh! Growing up, I was, my friend group was more into Magic the Gathering, so... Oh, we well, had a, you do have that background. Yeah, we had a league, a little league or whatever at the local card shop that we went to. Nice. That was nice. a lot of fun. Alright. Without further yep. ado, let's begin. Best of luck to you. Alright. I like going one by one because... Like how you would do it in a normal pack. Ooh. Range battle ox would be good. Yeah, I think it will be quite the spicy card. Yeah, I know it's chaos cards and beasts in this deck and this pack. Berserk <laughs> Gorilla. The main two. Yeah, Berserk Gorilla. Yeah, nothing great there. Or <laughs> ooh, you can't use. Could be good. Could be good. With beast, yeah. Mad Dog of Darkness ain't bad. Nope, not bad at all. Let's see if I have better luck than the progression series. But, yeah, probably the underdog, maybe. Yeah. Probably maybe. not. We'll see. We'll see what the rest of the cards. <laughs> Sell the shark button. <laughs> Trap Jammer will be good. Or actually, will it? I don't know. Question. Ooh, right? Hyper Hammerhead. Yeah. It, it will be interesting. Depending on, on what traps come in this set. Yeah, another arranged battle box. And another, another trap, trap jammer. jammer. <laughs> Nothing super exciting yet, but some decent stuff. Oh, there's the Sea Serpent Warrior of Darkness oh, and a oh. Chaos Sword. Hero <laughs> Mergers, Chaos Sword, sure, there you go. But I wonder if this pack brings enough light to make them useful. That's a good question. I mean, you have the Ajamas if you really need it. Ooh, <laughs> not that's, again. That's not <laughs> you know, again. You know, you pulled it too? <laughs> I pulled this that in my exact... series. Yes, this, this is the exact secret error I pulled in my progression series. Ah, oh, never lucky, Robert not... Ducky. <laughs> yeah, same. Same here. Alright, here we are with... Alright, alright, alright. The animal. He's going to be pulling... Monster. He's going to be pulling from Invasion of Chaos to face the opponent, Sign. Green Maj. Okay. I yeah. like that. I know you You said that last time, too. When uh, back way back invasion of chaos, you were like, "Oh my God, Green Mage!" You and never played him. <laughs> yeah, I never got the deck to play. Okay. Mm. Mm. If I get BLS. If you get BLS. You say that as if I'm not gonna get him. 
Watch I, this. I say that as if you won't won't get them. Here's my smashing ground. Oh, primal seed. I can do the thing. Okay. No BLS. There's another Anything smashing back. ground though, and yeah, chaos sword. Oh, Jama Black! Oh, Jama Black! Nothing there. <laughs> oh. I like that. That's what you said last time, too. New bug. Looks like the heart of the underdog is becoming more and more useful. Yeah. This player drama. A lot of vanilla beaters. It's interesting more poison game in this pack. It is. Yeah, black tire right now. <laughs> wow, you're just not getting lucky, man. Like there are good cards on their own, but come on, let's face oh. it. We all want BLS. We want to see you pull BLS, BLS or or, <laughs> or Chaos oh, Empress. Yeah, they didn't get lucky. None of us got lucky in my progression series, and none of us pulled it. <laughs> Either one. So that, that was unfortunate. Gigantus. You've become a big fan of the Gigantus lady. I think that's the third smashing ground too. Compulse, you never got that in our in, in uh in the our progression. I, I don't think you did. Oh well. I don't remember you using it against me. I think you would have if it was first seal. Also, hard underdog is looking better by the second. That's what I've been saying. <laughs> Look at that. Like with, the, with the blazing and patches and all that. Oh, that's the, the bizarre. Orca, really? <laughs> Yikes! Another good candy, so I like to see that. Dark Triceratops. Eh. Yep. Get that piercing damage. Another Heart of the Underdog. Trying to Delta Hurricane. Select the short button. Come on. Hang in there, hang in there. I'm pretty sure I got a good <laughs> feeling about this pack. There's Heart of the Underdog. Ojama Black? Oh. TZ Designator. <laughs> All these superheroes, man. <laughs> Can we get this man a BLS, please? You know what? It probably knows that BLS isn't the card you need to win, so it's not giving you BLS. That's probably know, what's happening. <laughs> With all these are dramas. No, it's giving you vanillas. It's giving you what you need. Vanillas. Heart of the Underdog yeah, and Vanillas. I, I'm pretty sure I've drawn three Heart of the Underdog yeah. at this point. So that might be the strat. Yeah, yeah, look, look. It, 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 it's saying you do not be, need BLS. There's barely any lights. There's barely any darks. I'm not going to give you BLS. You're not going to need it. Here's some Chaos Sword. You might need this. Oh, man. You don't need BLS, son. You, this is what you need to win right here. Here you go. Here you go. You're being. You be, oh. Smashing, Smashing ground. ground. That's good. That's good. I'm surprised it's your first smashing ground. Should be. Yeah, that's the first one, but it's a good. Yikes. Ooh. And Rage Battle Walks. He's always happy about those. Mm. And I Rage need... Battle Walks. <laughs> <laughs> okay, yeah, yeah. Go ahead, Pax, give him a third one. Ooh. They said, ew, Gondok said that. <laughs> like, well, cool. Smashing ground, good lord, you have no shortage of them. Don't sleep on zero gravity, okay? Don't sleep on that card. Oh, I'm not, trust me. Yeah. <gasps> D Mark. Just okay. like in progression. Did I pull him in progression? I did pull him in progression. Good spell. Last pack. Oh, 
Wow. Yeah, well, then, now you do a nice uh, semi slow scroll through this, enough so that people can see it. But you pull. Not that yeah. slow. You can, you can speed up a little bit. <laughs> Alright, I'm sort of just looking back to. Very well, it might just be normal monster beat man. I mean, it's looking like your only option, <laughs> unfortunately. Maybe. We'll see what I can come up with. Alright then. Okay, well, best of luck to you in deck building, and uh, we'll see you with your deck explanation. Alright. Okay, I am. Wow, actually. Because I got enraged battle ox, that that helps. And the Zerg Gorilla right next to it. Yeah. It, not bad. Oh. Oh. I don't think I need to flip this back. No, well, there is there is a card that you shouldn't sleep on in there. Destruction ring. No, zero gravity, of course. Oh well, I think I have plenty of that. All right. Neobug, Warrior of Darkness. I'm happy for those Soul Tigers. Chaos Sorcerer. I don't think I pulled too, too many lighter darks. Uh, the yeah. Thing in the Crater. I gotta check that card out. You got the Ojamas, buddy. I didn't get all of them. No, but you got some. The and they're light. Like Dimension Borderline, Yellow Luster Shield, Dimension Distortion, Multiplication of Ants, Stray Lambs. I could probably use Stray Lambs. Too bad I don't have anything to switch control of monsters between my opponent and I. But you do have the D Mock. The strat. What's the strat? Right. So, the main strat is just overall beatdown. We have a lot of high attack, almost just no tribute monsters like Berserk Gorilla, Mad Dog of Darkness, Neobug, and Blazing Apache. And going along with this, a lot more than half the monsters are normal, so using the heart of the underdog, get that draw power. Then got Hero Merges in here, kind of hoping to get off a big call or Giga, Giga, Giga off of that. Let me let, uh, go over Hero Merges again. So, uh, your opponent just has one random card from your hand, so you will hope to basically yeah. give him no choice but, you know. Uh, yeah, I'm not. How I'm thinking, I'm not gonna have. Too many spell traps in my hand, most likely, to begin with. Mm -hmm. So, likely are likely chances are when I activate this, my hand is just only going to be monsters. So, even if it's not one of these, which would be preferred, I'm still likely going to get a monster off of this. Gotcha. And you got then, what's the thought behind Trap Jammer? Trap Jammer. Put it in there just in case of things like I'm doing here with energy drain. Tell us, tell uh, us, tell us what you're doing with energy drain. So energy drain, uh, it gives an attack boost and defense boost for parts of my opponent's hand. I'm not quite sure how this is going to work out, but any like attack boost can only help, and this is like one of the only cards that does it. I think I didn't even notice. This is one of the like, I didn't even know this card existed when I read it and like, okay. Not bad, right? Yeah. So we'll see how that works out for me. But it should at least allow some of these guys to be able to be over something, hopefully. Hopefully. In case he has something higher. Yep. Uh, so yeah, Trap Jammer to help negate some of this. Maybe even Maybe Zero Gravity. It. Yeah. Yeah, if he's playing it. Maybe even zero gravity, which would just change all my attack position monsters to defense mode. So okay. that's the help of that. 
Gotta run Smashing Ground, just free monster destroy. Gotta run it, great card. Yeah, stray lands, more monsters on the board. Could yeah. maybe I just tribute fodder for these. I agree. Uh, I got a few little side strats going. Like, Enraged Battleox have a good chunk of beast monsters in here, so that piercing damage always helps. Much. A lot, a lot of earth monsters, so Gigantes. Also, background removal with the short of battle, so that's much. always good. Yeah. Got <laughs> balloon mystery in here. It's a wall, and it's a wall that does damage just when it gets destroyed. So yeah, so that in combination with thunder crash. Yeah. Just get all that damage. So hopefully, balloon mystery can last a little while, and then thunder crash deal all the burn damage off of that. Yeah. And then, assuming the game goes on for a while, I got Blasting Ruins in here for that 3,000 damage. Yikes, you really think but, it's gonna go for that while? That, I, 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 that one is questionable. I don't yeah, think this was good. questionable, but like, I just don't see... Like, I threw some cards in the side deck, like, maybe this would be better depending on how the duel it is, but... There's just nothing better I... Feel like I could add, and this could be like a one-off wins me the game for some reason. <laughs> All right, well, we'll have to see how it works out for you. Hopefully, it does work out for you. All right. Yeah. Thank you very much, and uh, we'll see you at the dueling arena. All right. Best of luck to you, duelist. Thank you. All right, guys, here we are with Animal's deck's explanation. All right, Animal, tell me what you got for us today. Okay, we have got our basic feeders. We've got our 2.1k wall. We've got a big boy beater. Uh, another beater. Another beater. Beater that uh, destroys back row. Beater that pierces. <laughs> beater. Not a beater, but I mean, beater that destroys monster at the end of damage step. Destroy? No, returns to hand. Right, right. But he's good for getting past walls. Okay. That card's ridiculous for getting past walls. Yeah. Yeah. <coughs> and yet, here you are playing a wall. Princess. Thorny Princess. Mm -hmm. Is that her name? Thorny Princess? Oh, prickly. Figure fairy. fairy. Figure fairy, not Thorny Princess. What am I saying? Yeah, here you are playing a wall. Even though you know, most likely, your opponent is probably running the same card you are. What's, that, what's stopping me from changing my zero gravity to his zero gravity? <laughs> Honestly. Well, it depends who gets it first. But carry on. Um. No, we also skip okay. Gale Lizard, and Gale Lizard returns monsters to hand. Yeah. Oh yeah, he's just painting. <sighs> you're you're burning. Why are you burning? And you be <laughs> because well, okay, all right. And. This is the Chaos Pack, so I want to be able to disrupt some of his plays, if I can. Gotcha, you feel like if he's running Chaos, then this would be a good one. Well, shouldn't it be a side deck card then? Wouldn't somebody like, I don't know, the 1800 beater in your side deck help you more? We'll find out, game one. Alright. He... I like him. He's all right. He might get big, or he might not get big. Yeah, so we're gonna find out. Game That's one. All, yeah, I, I I think he'll get big in both big in both games. At least big enough. You're big enough. Yeah. That, I'm scared about that one. Yeah, could be good. Could be not. It could be really good because that could make him a 2700 or him a 3K. The the bad part is that you only have three targets for him. I mean, technically, no. You have more than three. Yeah, you have you have six targets. Okay, could be good. That don't count. It counts. Oh, but come on, you would never do it with that, would you? Oh, beast or beast warrior. Yeah, no. Of I don't. course, I'd do it with this if I was in a pinch. Okay. But yeah, my main targets are. Yeah. My raid battle losses. Six targets. You have six targets. Yeah, I'd say that's enough to at least give it a shot. 
Smashing Ground does what Smashing Ground does. You've all seen it. Yeah. Unless you haven't seen the progression series, and if uh, you haven't, I would highly recommend watching it. Highly. Stay away from the first few episodes. Yeah, the first four. The first four. They no, ten. No, what? Ten? Well, I mean, you say that because you quit on number ten, but no, I think after... Wait, after what? You quit on number ten. Number ten was, 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 one, was the one where you rage quit. Which one was number ten? The, the burn one. The really oh. bad burn one. Oh. Yeah. I didn't remember that one. That's alright. A very, it was a, a very emotional time for you. It doesn't really get exciting till Invasion of Chaos, right? And that's like Pac-10? No, no, it doesn't get really exciting till... GX era? Episode 5. Episode 5. No. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Episode 6 is the one where you burn <laughs> me. You probably don't even recall how you burn me on Episode 6. I don't. It was the debut of the Mighty Fairy Box. Oh. Oh, is that the one where you freaking went and killed yourself? Yeah, well, I didn't kill myself. Fairy Box killed me. You attacked first. I mean, <laughs> am I supposed to do leave your monster there? Come on. Well, I mean, if you can't beat over it. I was being able. I, was, I had the attack power to beat over it. It's just. Freaking dragon had too much defense and fairy box kept landing four times in a row. Chances are it wasn't gonna be like that, but you know, it, I'm dealing with animal here, so like chances be damn. It's all it's, it's all gonna go his favor. <laughs> so I also have two copies of Heart of the Underdog. Just to give me some draw power, I know that very little of my deck is normal monsters. Yeah, I don't think this is going to be very effective. I don't see it. I figure it's enough, though. I figure it's it... enough to at least get me something out of it. It'll get you maybe one card. Okay, different dimension borderline, it's a spell card. Uh, destruction ring. It's a burn that, funnily enough, helps me set up for Gigantes. It's an okay tech. A hero emerges. I'm so, hoping so, to do this with mostly monsters. And that's how you plan to bring out the monk, I see. Maybe big Kobala too. <laughs> okay. Uh, energy drain. Very nice card. I mean... Zero we gravity. don't know if he's gonna see me running walls and go, Okay, time to play zero gravity. Alright, Compulse, yeah. self-explanatory, and here's a card that is like, what the hell are you thinking? Hey, you approved of it just I before the recording. No, 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 no. All I said is, maybe at one. Wait, where did the other one come I thought I put the one... Which card, which card did I screw up on? I don't know. Maybe that one. No, 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 because like... I took one of those out. Oh well. <laughs> Takes out a bricks and puts in another brick. <laughs> <laughs> Let's do this. All right then. Best of luck to you, duelists. See you at the dueling arena. All right, everyone. Here we are at the dueling arena. I'd like to welcome you to this Yu-Gi-Oh progression draft exam. Right next to me, I have my uh, co-pilot. Deadpool! So you two finally met up in real life, huh? Alright. So, Animal? How were those packs? How were those packs? Give us a little... Were your packs any good? You already know this. I do, but... You were with me while I was pulling. I do, I do. You think I'm gonna give Sign any info on him? I do. All right. I also that's know that's how. Cool, my guy. <laughs> I also know how signed pools were, and uh, they were extremely satisfying. Uh, <laughs> best of luck uh, to you both. That, that BLS. <laughs> I pulled all the secret rares. Yeah, all the secret rares. All right. 
Let the duel begin. <sighs> time for me to deal with enraged battle ox. I think it's time for both of you to deal with enraged battle ox. All right. So, starting off, I will set to activate part of the underdog and normal summon a blazing Apache. So on the bottom oh, wow. here, obviously we have uh, sign, and on the top we have animal. And that will conclude my turn. Well, I set one, two, face down, and a face down monster. Pass to you. Activate hard underdog to draw a card. Sign going plus here. I will set a monster, move to battle, attack with placing an Apache on your face. Alright. Energy drain on the placing an Apache to make it gain attack points equal to the number of cards in your hand. What a move! Nice. That's my turn. Not see that coming. Didn't even see the sword I will set one. Normal summon a blazing Apache. Move to battle. Attack your face down. <laughs> yep. It's another wall. <laughs> That's exactly what I was expecting. I'll pass. I gotta say that energy drain is a fantastic card. Really got in there. Blazing Impachi. Attack the face down. Is he gonna steal his knife? Another <laughs> wall! <laughs> I see we're evenly matched. Yeah. Oh, uh, not really, because he's got a heart of the underdog. And you do not. Get. Let's see. I will set one. Position all my monsters. Activate zero gravity. Alright. Ooh, Ooh, Adam was about to take some battle. big damage here. Activate zero gravity. Alright. <laughs> and the turbo and the tables have turned. Literally. Oh, I can't wait to ask. Yikes. Well, a banished soul tiger to summon Gigantes. Ooh. I'll summon Stealth Bird and attack. Enter battle. Beat over Impachi. Beat over Soul Tiger. Beat over Impachi. Main phase 2. Different dimension borderline. Activate Stealth Bird. Now neither See. player can conduct their battle phase. Activate her longer than all. Last is in session. Let's get some. Well, looks like Animal going for the classic deck out strategy. Is it deck out? No, it's yes. for damage. It, no, it's wait, neither of them. Uh, it looks really? to me like he's just doing yeah. any, getting any damage nope, any way he can. Out next turn. The self bird does a thousand damage each time you flip it. Yep, there you go. That's burn damage. That's good. Yeah, burn damage. Ah. Uh, then I either burn you or try to take you out. Activate destroy lambs. <laughs> uh, you know what? I didn't even think of using those as tribute fodder. And mistakes were made. <laughs> and uh, I will go ahead and set. Well, that one. Flip stealth bird. Not I sure I that. actually have a way out of this. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> you got five more turns. Wait, her the underdog? No, well, you got the draw power to maybe to, to get there. And there's the way out. Wait, I 
Why is it oh, I, I don't... I think Gagani's is pretty much the only way for back to the board, so That's the problem. And so neither I, of us can attack with Gigantes. Yeah, so I, I think I'm literally just a little screwed here. <laughs> Well, activate Heart of the Underdog. Let's go. Let's go, third. Pass. Activate Heart of the Underdog. <laughs> yeah. Set. <laughs> Let's go, third. The only way I could win is if I managed to outburn him. And then, yeah, looking at your yeah. levels, yeah. Yeah, it's a little late right now. It's so fair. It's so fair. Neither. And during our deck explanation, Gundok was telling me that this deck had no chance of working. I don't remember saying that. I just, I just, some of the cards there that you picked, I thought I deemed them questionable. But I wish you the best so luck on the way. Dimension borderline. I never said anything about Stealth Bird. It was, I, what I said was that trap card that you were running. That I was like, what, what is that? What even is that? <clears throat> ah. Well, which Doctor Chaos. There we go. <laughs> Alright, round two. Well, I'll set one to the Neo Bug and pass. Alright. I will activate Smashing Ground to destroy your new bug. Yikes. That one. Almost on Blazing and Bashy. Attack you directly. Alright. In phase. Well. I set one. Banish Neo Bug to summon Gigantes. Alright. Activate Smashing Ground. Alright. Summon Stealth Bird. Alright. Swing with Bowl. Main phase 2. Don't tell me he has it again. Do you- does he- oh no, he already used Mashing Ground, he can't use it again. Oh, that's true. I'm going to... I thought we were we were seeing this another death pool scenario here. Do you remember death pool? Oh my! Oh, that's one big ape. Mistake. Activate death pool oh. merges. Oh! Pull that. Yo! Yeah. He's done it. <laughs> oh man! During the end of the chaos. And got Smashing Ground back to this end. It is not looking. I'm so sorry. Uh, you do not deserve this sign. This I is take Smashing Ground. All right. I set one. I swing with both. That's right, zero gravity. Ah, fair enough. You do not deserve this sign. This is Animal's <laughs> luck at its full power. Oh wait, we're about to see Big Koala make an appearance. Oh. I set one. Pass. I set one. Why didn't you stay okay. on your It's another wall. Yeah, let's just banish that. Change 
Gigantes and Dark Magician of Chaos to Defense. Oh no. Take Zero Gravity. Battle phase. Right. It is over. Not quite. He still has life points. Watch him have stealth. So Soul Tiger, change Dark Magician of Chaos to Defense. And now there's Zero Gravity, that's just not fair. Battle phase. Question mark? Oh, I mean... Why would you do... Zero Gravity? Yeah. Again. Activate your Zero Gravity! Ha! <laughs> your emerge is okay, that's cool. It's something. How much I could have done about that. Wow, just... Gondok will just wonder how in the world that worked. It, it's called Animal Slug um... pulling through again. <laughs> yeah. yeah. He, 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 he yeah. did it again, Deathpool. He did it again. I think you definitely got better on the hand draws this go around. <laughs> yeah, pull, pull, pulling the one, oh, the Magician yeah, of I Chaos. Might be better. Yeah. Did you, by chance, pull the VLS? No. I pulled a couple- Let me guess, of you pulled it, you know Huh? Let me guess, you pulled it? No, sadly. Because I even pulled Primal Sneed. I was hoping to pull off some jank maneuver like Infinite Wild Nature's release with Enraged Battle Ops. Wow, I am just outstanding by what I just witnessed. Man, I was hoping to do a little better than that. <laughs> I, me, me too, like, look, my jaw dropped, okay? I, I just did not see that coming. Like, Animal just completely drew the nuts. Both times, actually. I mean, he does it, he does it against me constantly, but, you know, I mean, I've only seen him do it against somebody else right here with my uh, co-host over here, Deathpool. He did that against Deathpool, and here he is doing it against you too. He also He's pulled doing three it smashing grounds. So no, 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 no. He, he, he doesn't. It's more fair other times, but today his luck was just outrageously. Uh, Animal, do us all a favor. Go play the lotto, would you? Right now, go play the lotto and uh, <laughs> donate. Uh, I just, I'm, I'm fine with a thousand dollars. I don't need more. So just go to the grocery store right now, go play the lotto. I'm pretty sure you'll be <laughs> pleasantly surprised with with your results. No, I don't feel like dealing with all that tax stuff. Uh, <laughs> great, great. Doesn't play the lotto because he doesn't want to deal with the tax system. Alright. <laughs> that and I don't think I'll win. Uh, well, I'll I tell you what. At sign, do you think he'll win? <laughs> I mean... Considering those last two matches... No, so I'm like, he already used up all his luck. I'm starting to think that animals should not be allowed to kind of participate. <laughs> Ban him from the Yu-Gi-Oh! Draft Series! Ban him! <laughs> it's, it's, just, it's just, 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 he's, he's too much luck, too much luck, too, too overwhelming. Overwhelming yeah. on new contest contestants. Well, you know what? Don't worry about it. Uh, sign. We're gonna be seeing sign in the next tournament, uh, the Duelist Kingdom tournament. Uh, I hope you are as excited as I am, sign and animal, because uh, yeah. it is gonna be coming very very soon.